guys. Morning, Stan. Morning, Stan. Stan. Sorry, I'm a little late this morning. No problem. I, I heard it might rain today. Yeah, I heard that too. Brought my umbrella just in case. Uh, Ernie, how's Doris? Still got the flu? Yeah, yeah, she's still got it. <laughs> Getting over it though. <laughs> That's good. you're driving today. Oh, Fred's car's in the shop. Cars, they really do run our lives, don't they? <laughs> I have an announcement to make. I'm pregnant! Today, September 14th, is my last day in this carpool. <laughs> no, now, I, I'm serious. Today is my very last day in this car <laughs> Okay, Stan, give us the punchline. <laughs> no, but I'm serious. Your voice isn't trembling enough. Har <laughs> har, such a riot. No, I am leaving this car <laughs> I think he's serious. No, he's not. Can't you tell when someone's pulling your leg, Ernie? Bob, I'm leaving. But, but why? Why? Well, Tom Frampton had an open spot in his carpool, and I, I accepted. You accepted? Uh, Tom leaves a half an hour earlier than you guys, and he works in the next building. And, and Tom's a good friend. <gasps> and we are not, we are not your friends. No, I didn't say Stan, that. Stan, Stan, we're a team. The four of us a team. Damn it, we've developed a great rapport. And you want to change that? Why? Why? I'm not trying to destroy it. Oh, him. God, Stan. I consider myself blessed to be in this carpool. I thank God every night before I go to bed that I try to work with the people that I do. I never thought that anybody would want to change perfection. Oh, come on, it wasn't perfection. Hey, it was close. It was damn close. <laughs> if only you have been more patient. I'm only doing this out of the sake of convenience. Level with us, Stan boy. Come right out with it. What do you mean? You're not leaving us because it's more convenient. You're leaving because of us. Is it us, Stan? Is it us? It has nothing to do with Stan, you Stan, Stan, we're just trying to understand. What we need to do is talk it through. You really want to know? I do. Come on, just rap with me. Rap with me. Fred, I don't want to rap with you. I rap with my kids all the time. It's really beautiful. Every man has to rap at some point in his life. No man is an island. This is the time. Why the hell should he rap? He'd only say how much he hated us. But I don't hate Stan, you. Stan, Stan. Love, hate. Two sides of the same coin, big guy. Don't break us up, Stan. We're a team. We're not a team. Don't you mean you're not a team? I'll change. We'll all change. I'm not going to change for that bastard. See what bitterness you've caused by holding it all in? Talk to me, guy. Rap with me. All we want is the truth. You want the truth? No. The truth. I just want us all back together again. No truth. How I really feel? Go for it, guy. Hey. Okay. I really feel that you guys are dull. Oh. Well. Dull. He used the word dull, didn't he? Okay. I, mean, I can deal with that. I can deal with that. We get together in the morning, and what do we talk about? The weather, Doris's flu, and our cars. Not once have we discussed anything more important than Bob's last business lunch. I can't talk in the mornings. I can barely walk in the morning. I, I need a carpool that's really me. I may go on searching forever. I may never find it. But somewhere, somewhere there's a carpool with a door open for me. Then stay with us, Stan. We'll try to make ourselves that carpool. It's, it's too late. I must move on. You son of a bomb, you maniac! Now you off the drive! What are you trying to do, kill us? Don't you realize what you've done? You've taken our hearts and gone, stop, 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 stop! I never meant to hurt you. Hurt? I never knew what hurt was until now. I think you're taking this too hard, Ernie. Yes, yes, another fault of mine. Any others you care to tell me about? Okay, it's rapping time. You really want to know? Yes, yes, all right, all right, go ahead, go ahead. Drown me in it, see if I care anymore. 
All right. Well, you're tied. I knew it. Oh, I knew I should have worn this tie today. I wish I forgot to wear it. Now I thought she was just big on the bed because she had the flu. Oh, God, why not listen? Now we're really rapping. This is wonderful. Okay, Stan, what do you hate about me? You know what I hate, Fred? I really hate rapping! Super, now, Bob. No way! I don't want to hear another word out of this jerk. Bob, I sense some bitterness coming from you. Just tell me one thing. Why Tom Frampton? Why his carpool? What's wrong with Tom Frampton? He's a creep. He's someone I'd never think of letting into my lane, and yet you're going over to him. It makes me sick. He's using you. Can't you see that? He's using you to get to me. What? Sure. I was in his carpool five years ago, and I left. He's never forgotten that. Bob, I didn't know. Bob, you never told us this. It's something I don't like to talk about. A chapter in my life I thought was closed. Bob, I feel so close to you now. I feel so close to all of you. A breakthrough! Then, then you're staying. <laughs> I just can't be sure anymore about anything. In your we found out how we really feel about each other, and that is beautiful. Yes, yes, I suppose it is. Well, I guess I could give it another try. <laughs> but what about Bob? Bob! Does he want me back? I don't think things could ever be the way they were. Bob, we don't want things the way they were. We want them better. And they can't be better without you, Bob. Well, I suppose a test drive wouldn't hurt. <laughs> <laughs> what a wonderful day it's become. <laughs> Looks like it might rain, though. Brought my umbrella just in case. It's good to be prepared. Mm. Mm. Mm.